Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week, as posted, Microsoft rolled out their latest Patch Tuesday cumulative update for Windows 11 version 22H2, which was KB5023706. And um, this update would have been downloaded and installed automatically and was a security update. But over and above being a very important security update, it did um, include the second wave of new features. Um, officially, that's have now been made available with the update for Windows 11 22H2, also known as the Moment 2 update. And um, I'll leave a link to that video in the description. Now, unfortunately, once again, according to user feedback and some reports now doing the rounds online, it seems that KB5023706 is causing issues. Um, and the update is slowing down SSD, so that's solid state drives or other boot devices, which means... Um, a, a drive that your operating system is installed on. Now, according to um, this feedback and these reports, it is having an impact on the performance of drives. And these reports are mainly over on Reddit and the like, where it's mainly affecting um, reading and writing. So that would be the write performance and reading speeds that have dropped quite significantly in some cases. And also boot times, which for one user who said um, their boot time went from 14 seconds to 31 seconds after the update. And uh, um, so that's reading and writing speeds, mainly using SSD NVMe drives. So NVMe, in case you uh, didn't know, stands for Non-Volatile Memory Express. And um, apparently um, speeds of those drives have been halved in some cases after the installation of that update. And apparently benchmark scores have dropped quite significantly for a lot of users who have posted their benchmark scores over on Reddit after installing the update. So it's mainly affecting reading and writing, boot times, and obviously those drive speeds have halved as mentioned. Now at this stage, um, reports are saying that um, uninstalling the update, basically rolling back and uninstalling the update is solving the issue. So um, at this stage, um, if you are experiencing experiencing these issues and you mainly have an SSD NVMe drive and you are experiencing some of the issues I have described then um, although it's not recommended for a security update but obviously if the um, negatives are outweighing the positives with side effects then you can always uninstall the update by heading to uninstall updates and here is the update 5023706 you click on uninstall follow the prompts uninstall uh, the update and then you would have to restart and then what I would do is pause the update as well so um, that means um, if we just head back to Windows update you would have to pause the update because if you don't because it's a compulsory mandatory update it will want to download and install automatically once again so just take note of that but as mentioned is an important security update so only uninstall that update um, if you are experiencing um, the issues described in this video and the negatives as mentioned are outweighing the positives and as yet, um, Microsoft hasn't commented or hasn't confirmed any of this. This is just um, user feedback and reports mainly on Reddit from a whole lot of different users after installing that update that um, mainly um, SSD NVMe drives, the speed is halved with other write performance issues and boot time issues as well. And I'll keep a close eye on this one. And if Microsoft does um, mention anything regarding this or makes it a known issue or rolls out a fix, I'll obviously post and let you know. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.